Good morning, fifth graders. <clears throat> Today, your assignment is going to be uh, going on to Google Classroom. You're going to open up a YouTube video that is a person reading your story for the week. Your story is titled Westlandia. So along with reading the story like normal, we're going to have some vocabulary practice along with some practice on drawing conclusions. So <clears throat> drawing conclusions is when you read some information, have a thought, and then you then conclude or gather all that information and put it into what your belief is or what you are going to conclude the meaning of it is. Um, for today, I'm going to let you just kind of give it a try. I understand that we maybe haven't done a lot of drawing conclusions, so I will be at my computer if you have any questions. Um, <clears throat> another thing about this that's going to be a little different is you're going to have to fill a worksheet out on your computer or device. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. And what you are going to do is if this is your paper, Okay, I will send it to you in Google Slides. This is your paper. Obviously, it's really hard to see right now. What I would recommend doing is zooming in. Well, that's a little bit too close. All right, so maybe here. So the first question says, the ways of living of a people or nation. So if we think that's civilization, I can't just click right here. So my personal preference is to add a text box, okay? So if I do that, now I can type civilization. <clears throat> if you wanted to do it another way, I spelled that wrong. If you wanna do it a different way where you actually write, like with your mouse or your finger if you have an iPad, you go up to this bar here and come down to scribble and now, um, if I wanted to write civilization, I could just go like this. Oop, it wasn't on my scribble. Here we go. Why? All right, so you see how difficult it is to scribble. Leave I showed you how to do scribble. Yes, I do. I am going to recommend that you go with the text box. Um, so again, I'll show you how to do the text box. If we're going to do number two here, right here where there's a T inside of a box, click that, and you drag over. And now I can type whatever I want. I'm not even going to read the question, so don't copy this answer down. But if I was to write fleeing, that is all you need to do. And then click off of it. Now when you share this with me, I will see your answers that you have put in these boxes. So this is your vocab practice. This sheet right here is your drawing conclusions practice. So. Up here, it gives you the definition of what a conclusion is. Down here, like always, is your reading that you'll do for the day or for the work, worksheet. And you're going to come up with four details from this reading. Using those four details, you're going to come up with a conclusion or a final understanding of that reading. Like always, if you have any questions, um, feel free to ask me. Uh, jump into my Google Meet, email me. You can even call school if you want. <clears throat> Other than that, that's all I got. Have a great day.